Now we're cruising off to beautiful Corpus Christi, Texas, where I recently had the honor of judging a chili cook-off at the Blue Marlin Saloon to benefit the Purple Door Women's Shelter. Trailer for sale or rent. Rooms to lend 50 cents. No phone, no pool, no pets. I ain't got no cigarettes on me. As I said earlier, I was invited to judge the chili cook-off and got to taste 24 homemade chilies. It's a tough job, but somebody has to do it. From scale to one to five. I'd actually give this one a four. It was non-stop chili tasting for around 30 minutes that beautiful day in Corpus at the Blue Marlin Saloon. Oh yeah. The sinuses are starting to go now. It took a while to get there, but we were all in agreement that number 22 conquered the competition at the chili cook-off. Very little fault in this one. It's got that chili flavor. I think we have our first five, ladies and gentlemen. The husband and wife duo of Team Double J took home first and second place trophies and $1,300 in cash. You know, I got to believe this. Their husband and wife team, and number one went to $22. Oh, Event organizer Gene Thornton did a fabulous job of putting this very worthy event together. Well, I'm over here in Corpus Christi, Texas at North Beach. I'm over here working in one of the refineries and I hang out at a place called Blue Marlin Saloon. And I got with owners one day and uh, we talked about putting on a, an event and I thought a chili cook-off would be good. And so we wanted a bent to benefit some kind of charity. So we got a hold of Holly at the Purple Door. And uh, that's about it, Jim. As Gene said, proceeds from Blue Marlin Saloon's first annual chili cook-off went to a very worthy organization in Corpus Christi, the Purple Door. Here's Holly from the Purple Door. So we are the Purple Door. We serve victims and survivors of domestic violence and sexual assault. Um, we have a shelter for victims. We have a 24-7 hotline, 24-7, 365. Um, we have counseling, we have legal advocacy, we have a hospital accompaniment for domestic violence victims and sexual assault victims. We do education as well, so we go out in the community and talk about what healthy relationships look like, um, red flags that you might look for in your own relationships to see if they are healthy or not. Um, and we believe that prevention is action, so um, we're trying to work ourselves out of a job by preventing domestic violence before it starts. We had a wonderful weekend in Corpus Christi, Texas. I got to judge a chili cook-off, stayed in a fabulous hotel on the beach, and took in some sightseeing, like the USS Lexington Museum and the Texas State Aquarium. Next time you're in Corpus, wet your whistle at the Blue Marlin Saloon and tell them Jim King of the Road sent you. King of the Road. <laughs> Here comes this week's Honky Tonk Texas Fabulous Flashback. No lie, I came by here a couple years ago. You're in a different, little different location. A little bit different. And this lady sticks her head out the window and says, Hey, King, have you had your butt on a bun today? I thought she was um, getting awful personal with me about my butt. Well, maybe it needed to be on a bun. <laughs> it's either X-rated or, or awful personal, man. Oh, it's awful good, though. It's butt on the bun from the big wheel. It's pork butt on a bun, all like you like. Hey, How you doing, Kathy? What's going on? Look what I got here. This is called butt on a bun. A butt on a bun? Butt on a bun. No kidding. Yeah. Butt on a bun. It's like a bite? Nope. <laughs> King of the road. That was this week's Honky Tonk Texas Fabulous Flashback. The Texas Honky Tonk. 
Since 2008, Honky Tonk Texas and Silsby Texas has featured a steady stream of the very best in local, regional, and national touring bands. Pack up your posse and boot scoot over to Honky Tonk Texas for great concerts, dancing, drinking, and dining. Of course, steak night is every Thursday, and don't forget about the Honky Tonk Grill. Visit them online at facebook.com slash honkytonktx and at honkytonktexas.us. Honky Tonk Texas and Silsby has been entertaining Southeast Texas since 2008. Where have you been? 